What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Dre again. And, um, you know, I've been getting uh, several responses to my video concerning Brian Karn. Um, I just want to say this, you know, I can't be loud like I want to. I'm at Walmart right now, you know, just chilling. So I'm just going to say this and I'm going to let it be. All right. If you are a leader in the body of Christ and you have not called out Brian Karn yet for the assault that he brings on the body of Christ. Okay. Um, if you are more interested in who is qualified to call somebody out than you are about the fact that even the people that you have deemed qualified has not said anything yet, then do not come at me when I decide to say something about it. Okay? And I'm going to call people out by name. I'm, I'm just going to be who I am. Lionel Blair, I'm talking about you. Um, Matthew Stevenson, I'm talking about you. Um, Jamal Bryant, I'm talking about you. All right? The nigga needs to be out of the body of Christ. Plain and simple. Okay? And that's what I'm calling for. Until he get his act together, until he repents and comes back to Christ, okay? He needs to be kicked out of the body of Christ, okay? I'm going to put it out there. I do not like E. Bernard Jordan, okay? I have my reasons why. I don't like him. But he has gained a newfound respect from me, even if just a little bit, because he decided to do with you what you jelly backed, no spine having, pimp preachers have decided not to do. He called out Brian Karn. He told Brian Karn that if he, if this is in fact what he has did, and evidence has shown that this is what he's done then he needs to sit himself down. Come on. Out of the thousands, the ten thousands, the hundreds of thousands of preachers out there, only one? You folk make me ashamed to be a part of the body of Christ. Real talk.